Investigators are looking into four small fires in Jackson overnight. Steve Doty spoke with authorities on who could be responsible for the possible arsons. A melted bin outside the downtown Jackson post office and a charred dumpster outside a family skating rink is all that remains from a string of dumpster fires started Wednesday morning. Over the next couple of hours, we received a, a series of three more calls uh, for dumpster fires in the Jackson area, so we're continuing that investigation. Police received the first call around 1230 Wednesday morning, responding to a box lit on fire outside the downtown post office. From there, a call to all Fun Center. There wasn't any damage to any buildings or uh, any trees or anything in the area. We found out that the lids were melted off and it's a total loss. Leslie Oliver is owner of Allskate Fun Center and says she didn't see who lit her dumpster on fire, but she's got an idea. It's frustrating that kids will be out doing stuff like this with no supervision. Nothing to indicate that it was kids, although you know, there's been similar cases in the past. Police say they haven't had an incident like this in a few years, and that's why they believe these fires were related. The only thing, reason we have to believe that they are related is that it was a, a pretty short window and, uh, you know, two, two and a half hour time span. Police say evidence shows the fires were set for the dumpsters and not to harm anyone or any buildings. In Jackson, Steve Doty, Fox 47 News. And call the Jackson Fire Department if you have any information on those fires.